got it. Fish on. Hey YouTube, Garrett here, First Cast Angling. All right guys, uh, we're gonna go out and do some night fishing tonight. Uh, we're gonna go hit the river and uh, hopefully we can pull some flatheads out of there. Uh, it's been pretty slow here lately, but uh, things are starting to pick up a little bit. Uh, I don't know if it's if it's the time of the year or if it's just where we we ain't had a lot of rain and stuff. And uh, hopefully uh, we can get some here soon and it'll start making things a heck of a lot better. It's been been pretty slow for me on the river, but uh, like I said, hopefully things will start picking back up soon. So uh, yeah, guys, uh, I'm gonna get packed up and get the gear ready, and we're gonna head out that way. So I'll see you guys when I get to the river. All right, guys, we're down here in the spot. We're gonna sit here and fish this evening. Hopefully we get on some fish in a little bit. I got my cousin here with me standing over there. Say hi to the camera. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna sit here and hopefully get on some fish here in a little bit, guys. So uh, stay tuned. All right, guys, a little update here. We haven't uh, got on no fish yet, but we're trying. Seen a lot of stuff rolling in this current seam, so hopefully we get on some fish in a little bit. It's a little slow right now. Maybe they'll come strolling through at nighttime. But I'll get back to you guys when hopefully uh, we got a fish on. There, right, guys, it's just about dark. Still ain't got on nothing yet. <clears throat> Pretty slow right now. But we're hoping to catch something for you guys here in a little bit. Surely. Surely we get the skunk off the beach, or off the bank. <laughs> All right, guys, well, I'll get back to ends when hopefully we got a fish on. It'll probably be dark, but hopefully we got something on. Well, guys, just had the first run here on live bluegill. Something ran with it for a minute. I don't know if he's there or not. Well, there was a little bit of action. Kind of biting like a flathead. And ran with it for a minute and stopped. Well, I'll put it back down here and let it go, I guess. Do its thing. Little bait fish. Here guys, I'll get back to ends when hopefully uh hopefully I have it on this time. Here take it. You might have to grab the line. Just hold on to it for a minute. You feel him pulling. I was sitting here and I just I could hear the drag going. What'd you have on that? I hope we didn't miss that. It's been too slow of a night for that. Yeah, it was pulling drag. Whatever it was. You feel anything or? Good Lord, I just heard a big old roll up there or something. Bait fish over here. Where's that stick at? Oh, right here. 
rock. Oh. Yeah, I just... <laughs> I could hear it, man. I, you know, I heard the drag, but not as, not as much as, as if it was closer, but I heard it. Yeah, in that little, there you go, just like how you had it there. Just like that. Come on, man. I got it. Fish on. That's big. And it's pale and drag, too. Feels decent. Come on, bud. What in the world do we got? I don't know, man. It's fighting a little weird. Oh, there it goes. Finally got on something. What do we got? He's right here. It's a little flathead. Come here, bud. I'm gonna grab that net. Get it? Yeah. Hey, there we go. Finally, ain't skunked. Oh my goodness. And I didn't get lose my bait or my gear. There's a nice little flathead. You can set the pole down if you want and watch your watch your stuff. This guy's all fired up. Hey, there we go, guys. It's been a slow night. And uh, I finally got a flathead on this live bluegill. Oh yeah, nice hook set right in the middle of the mouth. Ouch. Okay. There he is, guys. First flathead of the night. <sighs> Get him at a better angle here, four inch. Yeah, there it is, guys. Oh, God. I'm falling to water. First one of the night, it's been a slow night, but we got on uh, this little guy, so that's pretty good. At least we're not skunked. All right, guys, one last look at this little flathead. <laughs> He's a nice little guy. He hit it hard, and he was fighting awful hard for as little as he is, but he took that whole bluegill. I'll let you guys see the release on him here once I get a hold of him. All right, bud, hang on. Well, he's out there now. All right, there we go. Uh, got the skunk off the bank. Thank goodness we are not skunk now. Uh, it's been a slow night, guys, really slow. It's, uh, let me see what time it is here. It's 11, 12, just caught that fish just now so and we've had some bites and stuff here and there but we've dealt with more snags tonight than anything but i'm gonna get this pole back baited back up and hopefully get on another one here in a little bit so i'll get back to you when hopefully i'm hooked up again nope missed him that time a little update here, guys. I ain't got on any more fish since that first flathead, but we're trying. It's a little slow out tonight. <laughs> it's a little slow out here. Temperature dropped way down, too. That might be, might be why they're kind of slow on biting. But hopefully, uh, hopefully we get on some fish here in a minute. What is it? Sounds like raccoons tearing each other up guys i think there's some raccoons down the bank here somewhere eating each other alive <laughs> no but there is something down there 
But I'll get back to you guys when hopefully I got a fish on. Oh yeah, he's still there. Getting some action here, guys. I don't know, that's what I'm saying. It's biting like a flathead. That's how they do do. They'll, they'll pull the line for a little bit. As soon as you pick it up, man, they drop it every time. Hope he didn't get me in a snag. I'll leave it sit. Oh. Yeah, there's a little bit of action still. I don't know, that's weird. A little bit of action for one pole while the other one's out. I know, we ain't got no other poles in the water, guys. We've only got one pole in the water because ran out of sinkers, got snagged up like crazy, and I ain't got no more sinkers to rig up. Kind of unprepared on this trip. But I'll get back to you guys when hopefully I get this fish or something. All right, guys, that's going to wrap this video up. Uh, wasn't too bad of a trip. Uh, went out and got on one flathead for the video. Uh, didn't get skunk, so that was that was nice. I mean, we only caught one fish through the whole night, and uh, it was pretty pretty cool to catch him, though. I haven't caught a flathead like that, and it's been a little while, so that fish was uh, pretty rewarding and uh, appreciated. So, But, uh, yeah, guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, hit the like button and uh, subscribe to my channel if you're new. And uh, keep supporting me. Uh, it's been a been a pretty uh, pretty good time on YouTube my first year or whatever. So uh, hopefully uh, things will start getting better here soon on the water, and I can start getting more fish out for you. Got more content out so you guys can see these fish that I'm catching and stuff. I know back some of my earlier videos I was catching them, uh, you know, broad daylight like nothing, like just going out at like three three in the evening to four and just you know what I mean catching them during the day so hopefully it'll get back to that soon we're getting closer to fall now the water's drop or the water temperature is dropping uh, hopefully these fish will start moving around and uh, feeding a lot more in my area I know some other people that fish Scioto River has been having a lot of a lot of good luck to them and uh, that's that's good you know at least somebody's catching something on the river but uh yeah it's been pretty slow for me here lately but again hopefully things start picking back up and we can uh start getting some good footage of some uh, good flatheads again maybe some blue cats you know but uh, yeah that's gonna wrap this video up guys again like it hit the subscribe button if you're new to my channel and uh keep supporting me so uh we'll see you guys in the next fishing adventure